friends and comrades, we're here today to lay a wreath at the statue of Liam Mellows and to remember his contribution to the struggle for an independent, democratic republic. Liam Mellows personified the spirit of Easter Week in 1916. He was principled and utterly determined to build an organisation that could win an independent Irish republic. He never flinched in the face of struggle, be it against the British Empire or the Irish Free State. As a teenager, he joined the IRB and the Fianna Erin and rose quickly through the ranks. In 1913, he was made a full-time organiser and in the same year, he became a founder member of the Irish Volunteers. He was arrested and deported to England, but he escaped and made his way back to Ireland in time for the rising. During Easter week of 1916, Mellows commanded the Western Division of the IRA, concentrated in East Galway. After the rising, Mellows evaded arrest by the British, exiled to the US to raise funds for the Republican movement. Mellows returned to Ireland in 1918, elected as a GD while abroad, and took up a role for the IRA during the War of Independence against British imperialism. Mellows opposed the treaty in 1921, stating that it would serve the Gombean class well, but could never deliver a republic. After the defeat of the anti-treaty IRA in early 1922, he was arrested and jailed in Mountjoy. He later remarked to his comrade, Pater O'Donnell, that the workers weren't with us. Echoing Connolly, he wrote that the Republican movement could have no faith in the state of the country people, and that instead we align ourselves with Tone and the men of no property. Public ownership and control of heavy industries, the transport system and banks, a shorter working day, and the confiscation of large farms without compensation and their distribution among the landless farmers and agricultural workers. Liam Mellows had an understanding of the need for a genuine anti imperialist politics. In the months leading up to his execution, the ideas that he outlined show his sharp insight into the political situation facing the Irish people and place him in the most radical. It's a time to remember the men and women who fought in 1916 and indeed all those who fought for us in the struggle for a 32 county socialist republic. Easter is a time for us to offer our vision as the Workers' Party of the type of society that we want to create. A new republic that will build on a united people and one that rejects utterly the backward politics of division or greed. In doing so, we build on the legacy and ideas of men like Liam Mellows.